What pieces of advice would you give to those um, tech leaders mm. who want to follow your footsteps and mm. migrate to Flutter? Yeah. Um, yeah. For one thing, uh, surely what I uh, just said uh, will really take time to to think about uh, the architecture of the app, take the learnings uh, that you had with the old app, try to... Um, use that chance, basically, right? Use a chance to have a greenfield mm -hmm. project, and then really try to get an expert uh, on board that can help you um, with, with the technology, to tackle all these hard problems, also make sure that your developers follow your certain uh, best practices that are in Flutter. And because usually you won't have these experts in your team if you choose a new technology. Of course, you can try to train your uh, developers on this, but uh, then that's going to cost you time, it's going to cost you money, and you're going to have to go through this whole trial and error phase, uh, which you usually just can't afford. So for us, it was very helpful to get external help uh, to, and also um, not just some consultant or some, some, uh, some coach that gives you a training and then leaves, but really somebody that sticks with you through the whole time of the project and, and really uh, guides you. Uh, uh, yeah, that really was really helpful for us.